Hey everyone, this is Sunglass Rob from SportRx and I'm here with Trusty Rusty who handles our money to talk about the differences on some Nikes. So there's some real similar stuff going on here but some subtle differences that you should probably know about. This is the brand new Maverick. This is the tried and true Bandit that we love around here. And this is the Bandit's smaller brother, the Fleet. So the idea of this video is to talk about the differences and the similarities. The devil's in the details, as they say. Thank you. Uh, so let's first talk about the Bandit and the Fleet because they're essentially the same exact pair of glasses. The only difference is the Fleet is a little bit smaller than the Bandit. So the Bandit, I would say, is about a large to extra large fit. And then I'll throw on the Fleet for you just so you can see what it, the Fleet as a smaller fit, I would say about a medium fit on what it looks like on a kind of a bigger head. It's just the same exact pair of glasses. I'd say like 15, 20% smaller, something like that. Amazing pair of glasses. And then the Maverick, I would say uh, is just about the same size as the Bandit, maybe a tiny, tiny bit difference. Uh, tiny, tiny bit smaller looking maybe, but very, very similar. I would say if you have a like rounder or wider head shape like I do, the the Maverick feels better than the Bandit because yeah. it's, when you look at it's got an ever so slightly well, let's talk about that and why. So I'm just gonna take the fleet. We don't really need it here right now. Let's, cause it's just a size thing. So these two are really similar glasses. And if you're out there on the interwebs trying to figure out which ones to get, like they're almost the same pair of glasses. Here are the main differences. But the, the idea with both of these is that you're getting a sport frame that looks like a non-sport frame. So it's like a lifestyle looking frame um, that still works really well for sports. Like I have some bandits in my prescription and I've gotten mountain biking in them and they work great. Um, but here's the, the Bandit is going to be a sportier, more on the sport spectrum, where the Maverick is going to be a little bit more on the lifestyle spectrum. And the main differences are the Bandit's going to have venting up along the top and the Maverick does not. So that's one main difference. And then the Bandit is going to have this kind of open temple system and the Maverick doesn't. And then all together, like even though they're almost the same fit, the Bandit is kind of like a thicker molded nylon frame. It's just a little bit kind of beefier, like just in the, just a little bit, like even right there, right there. And even on the temple, it's just a little bit thicker and kind of just like, I'm like they're just more like that. And the Mavericks are just more like that. Is that, like, is that worm to the pool. Yeah, yeah. So yeah. I would say both would work great in both situations, but if it's more mountain biking and less pool, get the bandits. If it's more pool and less mountain biking, get the Mavericks. Um, why don't you try both of them on for us and give us some kind of initial so thoughts this is and the feedbacks. Bandits. Yeah. It feels good. There is less flex to the frame yeah, because it's, it's thicker. Yeah. Like you can feel it when like my, when you, when you kind of pull them apart to put them on your face, like there's less give, but it still feels good. feels really solid. Like it's not going to go anywhere on my head. Maverick. You know, it's a little bit, it's a little bit more flexible, which I personally like because I have a very round head. I think the temples are a little more comfortable too. Like it just, it's a little bit lighter. I don't have quite as much confidence that no matter what, they're going to not fall off my face like I do with the bandit. But at the same time, like. Let's do I'm, a little test. Like go for a full on head shake. Like, you know, like you're rocking out. Yeah, nothing. Nothing, they don't move anyway. So um, both great glasses. I don't think you can really go wrong. If you're still not sure which one to get, I have an idea. You can call SportRx, we have opticians on the phones that would love to help you and kind of determine which one would, would be the best one for you. Or maybe even throw in that fleet if you have a smaller PD. Uh, speaking of PDs, we do everything in prescription. So if you need any kind of prescription uh, need for any of these, check out SportRx. You can always leave a comment down in the comment section. We will get back to you. You can email info at sportrx.com and we will respond to that as well if this video uh, helped you at all or if you just like his silliness i know what you're doing i'm just trying to be professional here give it a thumbs up uh we'd love for you to subscribe to the channel so you can see more of rusty's antics we let this guy count the money